So happy Tuesday, you know what I know? And uh, I don't have a minute on my memo card. <laughs> so uh, I better unblock the, uh, I mean, kind of stop this video and empty my memo card. I forgot, I don't have a minute left. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of humid again, kind of hot, but it ain't too bad. Sun's not out. Which is good news. All that stays like this, I'll be a happy camper. Yo, so I just finished my. I'll see how long it took, real quick. Uh, I'll tell you. I get the time on. It took me uh, 36 minutes. I started at 129, finished at 205. So. That's about what, 36 minutes. Not bad. Ugh, hot. Looks like it's got a storm. I just had to go to the gas station. I don't think I'm gonna get out tonight because I think I'm gonna watch my Star Wars movie. I was gonna do it last night. I just didn't. I didn't want to stop editing. Today I haven't edited anything. Uh, I keep getting emails about doing, I don't know, uh, a video on Archie Metal and Indiana basketball and uh, that's what all inspired and encouraged me. Uh, you know, I know down there a lot of people, you know, I did a lot of writings and stuff on basketball philosophy and then just Indiana basketball in general. Uh, and Indiana University basketball, etc. And uh, yeah, so they, uh, yeah, it looks like a kid I used to go to school with, Jason Glassborn, and here comes a fire on the So, right now we're gonna pull right over here. There we go, shoot. Yeah. Okay, well. So anyway, yeah, I don't know what's up with that. Hope everybody's okay. As usual, anytime you see that, you want the best for anybody. Uh, anyway, so yeah, I mean, those people from IU want me to do some videos. And they want me to do an interview with Dolce Mill. Uh, something I'd love to do. I'd be extremely difficult interview. I, I mean, because I would you know, I definitely represent the history and the tradition of Indiana University basketball if I interviewed them. And, and the questions would be extremely difficult. And that's why I'm hesitant. I mean, I wouldn't want to take them off, but, but I tell you, man, it'd be a extremely tough and difficult interview for him. I mean, my questions would be so complex and so in his face that uh, it'd be like he'd be, he was then going to pull the job all over again. And I, honestly, it'd be probably worse than that. Because all of you guys know, Indiana University basketball is everything to me. And, uh, and I'm telling you, it would be tough. Yo, so, tonight is a night of fuel, people. Uh, it's that simple. Another problem I have, uh, psychologically, is fuel. I, uh, 
because I'm a statistics person, so I worry about disease and so on and so forth, and it sucks. So, that is what's going on with me right now. It's fear of disease. A buddy of mine posted Daddy Rabbit. He's an old musician, and he, you know, he just, it's funny, he posts all these old songs and stuff. It's funny. Well, you know him, Alan. And uh, Eddie Rabbit was, uh, yeah, Eddie Rabbit was, uh, he posted an Eddie Rabbit song. And I, so uh, sometimes when that happens, I try to look up old musicians. Uh, I mean, old, you know, you know, I look up live performances to see if they go out on festivals performing it still. And I couldn't find any since 1990-something, 96. So I thought, man, surely he didn't die. And I looked it up, and he died of a in 1998. So then that makes me worry. <sighs> it sucks. So, you know, I'm... I also have a, like... Those times I'm like a hypochondriac. And I and not only that, but I have a phobia of illness, too. So, get an illness. So, not only do sometimes I think I have an illness, I also feel getting an illness. You know, so I get it. I don't know. I will. I have to. As you can tell, man, I'm mentally, I've been kind of all over the place. And I mean, I'm stable. I'm not like unsafe to be around or nothing like that. But. Man, it really messes you up when you feel about everything you do. I mean, you know. So, anyway. So, uh, I think I'm going to watch Star Wars tonight, I think. 